So my wife, knowing my interest in all things having to do with New Jersey history, cut this picture out of the Sunday edition of the Newark Star Ledger. I don't remember exactly what date it was, it's not on the clipping, and this has actually been knocking around my desk for some time now. But since I'm looking for material to write an article for Garden State Legacy magazine, I picked it up and looked at it again. It was sent to the ledger by Mary Seymour, and it's supposed to show President Woodrow Wilson with a group of other men in Elizabeth, New Jersey on May the 1st, 1913. But it makes the rather incredible claim of being the first photograph taken using flash photography outdoors at night. Well, that's a pretty tall claim, and I was kind of interested in knowing if this really is another New Jersey first. Aside from that, while President Wilson himself is rather obvious, I was wondering if I could identify who some of these other men with him were, and what was he doing in Elizabeth, New Jersey on May the 1st, 1913. I decided to make this little video documenting the process that I'm going to go through trying to learn the story behind this rather interesting picture.